In exercise number one, I'm going to show you how to deal with the most common obstacle that people face when learning the flamenco guitar style. And what that is, is doing the golpe at the same time as playing a chord, like this. What we do is we take the A finger, anular, and we strike it on the face of the guitar, and then we strike down with the index finger, and we do that at the same time. It's a singular movement. Now, when you're first trying this, you may be doing the A first and then the playing finger last, or opposite, and trying to sync that up. It's not easy at first, so what I recommend that you do is first strike down with your index finger, and then strike down with your golpe finger a few times, and just get used to the feeling of those movements on their own. Okay, strike, 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 and golpe, golpe, golpe. And then try and combine them and see how it goes. It's gonna be a little bit rough at the very beginning, but keep on trying to get them synced up at the same time. So for this exercise, we're doing A major chord. Okay, that's the first finger. It's doing a mini sejia on the E and the A notes, and the second finger on the second string. Uh, producing the C sharp. Okay. Now, why do we do this? We do this because we need the availability of the third finger for the upcoming exercises. So you'll see in your tab, which you can get over at patreon.com forward slash flamenco for you, is a downward stroke of the index and the golpe anular finger at the same time, and then an upstroke of the index finger also. And this is in cut time. So what do you have is one and two and three and four and once again. One and two and three and four and. So the purpose of this exercise is to give you practice with doing those two movements, downward index and golpe with the A finger at the same time. Okay, so let's give exercise number one a run through at 120 beats per minute for 10 repetitions. Two and. Alright, so good job. Exercise number two, we're going to introduce you to the 12 8 time signature. This is kind of the meat and potatoes of flamenco for compases like soleá and bulerías and so forth. We're working on soleá in this case for these exercises. Next, the accents. The accents are on the 3, 6, 8, 10, and 12. Let's try it. Un, do, tre, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, diez, once, doce. Un, do, tre, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, diez, once, doce. All right, so good. Now you've gotten a primer on the 12 beat. Now let's go ahead and return back to the guitar. So for exercise number two, we have only downstrokes with the index finger. And we have the golpe occurring on the accents, which are three, six, eight, ten, and twelve. Let's try it. Un, dos, tres. All right, great job. So for exercise number three, we're gonna mix it up a little bit on the left hand fretting fingers and add a hammer-on from the second fret here to the third fret as we're striking down with the index. And we're gonna do that for every single note that we strike. And of course, we're going to combine our golpe at the same time on the same accents, 3, 6, 8, 10, and 12. Un, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, diez, once, doce. Let's try that at 60 beats per minute. Here we go.
All right, great job. So let me break down this raqueo for you. It's going to be like this. One and two and one and two and golpe. Say it with me. One and two and one and two and golpe. Once again, one and two and one and two and golpe. Now on the guitar, one and two and one and two and golpe. Once again, one and two and one and two and golpe. Good. Now we're going to do that pattern two times. One and two and one and two and golpe. One and two and one and two and golpe. Next, we have three different patterns that are shorter. Say it with me again. One and two and golpe. Once again, one and two and golpe. On the guitar, one and two and golpe. One and two and golpe. One and two and golpe. So let's give it a run through at 120 beats per minute. That's it. Thank you so much for watching this tutorial, and I really hope that you got something out of it and learned something new on the flamenco guitar. And a special thanks for our Patreon supporters. Thank you so much for your support every month. If you're not currently a Patreon supporter, go and hop on over to patreon.com forward slash flamenco for you and become a supporter today and get cool benefits. Get all the tabs, get backing tracks, and more. So we'll see you on the next episode. Take care. Bye. For more information and to receive free materials, news updates, and more, subscribe to Ben's newsletter at flamencoforyou.com. Este pinche perro. Este pinche perro.